Hello guys, this time we'll see how easy it is to optimize our system in order to take less resources. Um, for this uh, we'll need some monitoring tool. So if you go to this address uh, and install this application, it's called Conkey. So basically here uh, you can uh, just uh, grab and download the application via pasting this and you can change the executable mode of the app image and run the program. So once you have uh, the program installed, it's very easy to see uh, what kind uh, of resources you need to add to your system or which of them are causing you troubles. For example, here uh, we see that uh, we have used 52% uh, of the RAM, so it's still okay. We have a buffer of the memory, uh, which uh, is still not full. Uh, and we are not using our uh, swap uh, drive. As far as uh, you can see, if uh, the CPU needs a replacement, and uh, that's pretty much what you can see from here. When you start browsing, uh, you can see which of those uh, might experience uh, um, delay, so you know what uh, you can replace from the hardware part. And don't forget that uh, also having a nice SSD replacement of your hard drive can increase the performance uh, from around three times to much more. Okay, that's uh, for the monitoring part. Now for the software part, I recommend, uh, for example, if you're using Ubuntu to place a lightweight uh, a desktop version, uh, that's uh, you can do directly from the terminal by typing sudo apt install lubuntu desktop and the difference in uh, memory usage and uh, performance you can really feel it um, so you may give it a try so that's how you optimize your uh, graphical environment next let's continue with the performance optimizations you can clean up your system for this uh, i recommend using bleachbit uh, so of course you have to download the package and uh, choose your version for example we'll choose uh, uh, something about uh, ubuntu it's a debian file and that's how bleachbit uh, looks like after being installed you can choose everything that you like to be clean i recommend leaving the bash history uh, and as well as uh, the free disk uh, space um, unchecked and while doing uh, the cleaning uh, please make sure that uh, your browser is open otherwise uh, your browser history can be erased so by clicking clean you see how many uh, things uh, bleach a bit can clean all right uh, and this will really declutter your hard drive all right the next application I recommend is uh, Ubuntu Cleaner. Uh, while it's not uh, supported by its uh, maintainer uh, no longer, but uh, we have a fork here in uh, uh, GitHub. So you can just uh, download uh, via Debian uh, the package here and install it. And uh, this Ubuntu Cleaner um, actually you choose with check marks what you would like to be scanned first and then when uh, you are absolutely sure of the things that you like to clean you just uh, again uh, check the check boxes and, and click on clean another uh, thing that i can recommend is uh, using a special uh, browser extension especially when you have uh, problems with uh, ram usage such as uh, auto tab discard or a tap wrangler uh, after some time they just uh, discard the inactive uh, tabs or reduce the and or free the memory which uh, those tabs uh, occupy of course you can specify in the options uh, that you would like uh, certain tabs to be uh, sticky or kept uh, longer and this will hugely improve your uh, performance uh, too so that's for now Please enjoy. If you have any more tips, I'll be glad if you can share them in the comments.